Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Let's the shot fly. Well done with that. Andre Sekera makes the stop and holds for the whistle. Time of the goal. Goalie to the bench, substitution made. Vegas has seen enough from their starters, just not been his night. Sometimes you just need to make a change. Oh, and it's off the mark. There's not really much place to go with the shot. He's trying to be perfect. He misses, and the puck rings around the boards. The clock has bled down to the last minute. Has it picked up? One minute left. Back on his stick. Bumped off. Gathered up again by Cassie. Brings it in for an attack. Score! Four in a row. Solid win at center ice. Now what? Now it's directed to dry cycle. Gives it on a cross from the point. Vegas in possession through center. Fires! No! If they move the net into the corner, maybe that hard shot's got a chance to be dangerous. Great save. Word from the home team's locker room is they're going to be short a player for the rest of the night. The injury occurred a while ago. He will not return. We are underway with period two. I bet a lot was said in one locker room in that first intermission. Let's see if it pays off with a different kind of score. Still has control up the wing. Perfect spot! Oh, what a move! That's the end. Good work by Ryan Nugent Hopkins. Play stopped. That puck is just hell. Well, the goalie will take these all day. His save percentage goes up. Click, click, click with muffins like this to stop. Defensive zone win. Propelled to Carlson. Flings it. Terrific glove save. And the referee's whistle has stopped play. Good set up off the win. Oh, and he robbed him. Edmonton's goaltender's been the game's first star so far. He's stopped several difficult opportunities while his offense has gotten him a couple of goals. The goalie's far and away been the best player in this hockey game. He has faced an inordinate amount of shots in this contest, stopped just about everything, and as a result, he's got to be the first star as his team is leading this game. The Golden Knights are skating it up at neutral ice. A backhand shot. Wonderful stop. Critical face-off win at that point. And it's a good pickup. Oh, what a hit that one was. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Drives it. Oh, a save there. Subban's able to handle this one. Vegas leaves its own end. From the outside. Score! They're back to within two now.
Knights are trying to fight their way back into this game. They trail now only by two here in the second. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. You win that, and you don't have to chase. They chase you. Ran into the defense. He's lost it. Vegas is skating in their own zone. He's got that one. Let's see what happens. Went to the backhand. Got the save there. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a face-off right near him. Just past three minutes played here in period two. They have scored, and so maybe there's momentum here. A shot. Good save. It's going to have to be something tougher than that to score. Terrific determination by Brazia. Collected by Stastny. Edmonton's looking to head man up the wing. Stepping behind the net, what'll he do? Say! Shoots! That was a great play and goal. You gotta think that's a game-changing save there. Carries it on in from center. Save there. Edmonton's carrying it around through center ice. Terrific defensive work. To Schmidt. He's in! And a save! Terrific determination by Paul Stastny. Rides the line. Malone's back on the ice here after that earlier fight. He's picked up his mitt, served the penalty, and we'll see if the score's been set. One on one. He was in score! They're back to within one. The Golden Knights have gotten back to within one. Loads of time left in the game. We're in the second period. Very entertaining evening of hockey here. We have had all kinds of chances and goals. The defense seems to take a little break. Maybe they'll show up for the last half of the game. Five minutes, 20 seconds. Took that draw and won it. Just fired it high. You want to score goals, you got to get to the front of the net. That's ex Holden's looking for some trouble here. Hurry up already. Drop your gloves. Whistle is blown. Now the penalty will be handed out. Add another penalty to this total. Every game presents a fork in the road opportunity, and this is it. It's a long five-on-three power play, and it begins now. This five-on-three power play has to be careful that they don't get lulled into a sense of security here, and they move the puck around the outside and never challenge the penalty killers. Just over six minutes off the clock. So they've gotten one. Let's see if they can get another. McDavid's bad night on faceoffs continues. Vegas looks up from the wing, and he's all alone. move not too slick there and he picks it up wow look at him he's got a long way to go does he have enough gas what a save made all alone play is stopped the net has come loose they'll put it back together solid clean win the Golden Knights have the puck at center ice. Offside is called, and so a neutral zone faceoff. And they've taken that faceoff between the blue lines and won it. On to Nugent Hopkins. Must get it out. Wonderful play by the defense. Flings it. Kicked away. Loose pocket went off one of the guys there. Shoots. That's terrific goaltending. The goaltender shuts that one down in a superb opportunity. Can he beat him here? A shot. Oh, what a terrific save in close.
nice face-off work. Vegas has possession in their own end. Just like shootout, they score! A shorthanded goal for multiple times in this game. Face-off win. Let's see what develops. In that defensive zone, an important play. Chip to Yamamoto. Takes it right back. Nice save there. They're going to have to do better than that to beat him. And another save. Mark him down for one more. Merrill's headed to neutral ice. The Golden Knights have it along the side at mid-ice. Got in the way of that one. The Oilers' prior record was terrific on the power play, but empty this time. Biggest chance of the game. He outskated him to beat the icing call. Shifts to the backhand and shoots. Skill play by Stone. Shot. He got a piece of that one. The shooter shaking his head. Great save. Just under nine minutes gone. If you like high-scoring games, you win today. It's tied up at five. And he holds on and stops playing. Good face-off win. Big drive. Great glove save. Good face-off victory there. At least he protected his goaltender. Shot on. Gathered up by Smith. To Bouchard. No way he's getting by there. And so, when you do that, you expect this. Doc, he knew he was going to have to fight after making that Bush League play. And out of all of this, both receive fighting majors. These games don't come along very often anymore where they're chippy, aggressive, over the line a lot of times with way too many penalties. This fight's mercifully ended for the visitors. The home crowd is ecstatic. They're making all kinds of noise. Vegas they won the faceoff. Vegas carrying it up the wing. Fires turned aside. Puck covered, whistle blown. face-off win. Smart recovery by Stastny. A textbook stick save. And on top of that, another great stop. What quickness side to side. That's a solid face-off win. Heaves one. That one gonged him. Edmonton's back in its own end, trying to work forward. Stone's one of those players that just strikes fear into the opponents. They have to be as sharp as they possibly can to not turn the puck over and give him a short ice to attack. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. McNabb's going to the box, and the call is tripping. This is an easy call for the official, Doc. Player made no attempt to play the puck and just tripped up the attacking player. Edmonton's power play has been highly effective, and it gets yet another chance off of this faceoff. But David is pickpocketed again. The Golden Knights slug that along through the neutral zone. He's alone! What an athletic save! Dogged to 
determination there by Eakin. Gathered up again by Larson. Slid back across from one point to the other. Shoots with no time whatsoever. He turned it aside. Now that's a timely save. A beautiful one. Edmonton's back to play in their own end as the clock ticks down on the power play. That puck exits the zone, so play has to reset. Skill play by Larson. And now we'll get the penalty call. Eakins going to the box. A player hit the ice, and the call on them is tripping. Edmonton's power play unit gets a rare five against three. It's a special time for them to rocket home some goals. Clean win on the draw. You don't get too many chances like this, Doc. A five on three power play. The key is to be aggressive, get the puck to the net, make those three penalty killers move all over the place. A chance to clear. Moving it to Carlson. Skates it into the zone. And a save. The Oilers are starting back in the defensive zone. Pressing on with it up the wing. Let's it go. Great save. Pass comes to him from the crease. Shoots. Great save in close. He had his eye on the puck the whole time. What a stop. Oh, a near miss. Carlson just missed on that attempt. Between the blue lines. Shoots one. Did not miss by much. Didn't drag it very well there. Loose puck. That puck's loose. Deflected away by Nugent Hopkins. Vegas has possession on the wing and neutralized. The big pillows came in handy. Good job in by himself. He's in. What a big breakaway stop. Slides it to the point. Shoots off the glove. Trying to go to Reeves. That puck is loose and good defensive play. Snapping a pass to Kara. The Golden Knights with possession in the defensive zone. And we have offside call here. A little over six minutes remaining. A wacky contest. Shoot from anywhere. It's tied at 5-5. It's dumped in. He slowed down a bit, and there'll be a hooking penalty called on this one. The Oilers have it at center ice. Got that pass in his own end. Vegas has been handed a minor, and the call is hooking. Edmonton's power play goes on a five-on-three for a brief time. Maybe enough. Let's see if they can get a pair here. Somebody got in early, and so offside is called. Edmonton's come up big on another faceoff. Alone! Terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at, and he made it tough. Score! have broken the tie and we're still in the second period much uncertainty about which way this game's going to go Edmonton's collected another victory on the faceoff pitching this one to dry side shoots a shot off his head tried but it didn't work steps across that line a solo rush big point blank save there beat him on that one shoots missed the net wow he got all of that as we used to say that's the hardest shot you can hear probably be better if he hit the net though Directing that one to Sakara. Looking to Cassian. It's all on his shoulders. Outstanding save with a glove. 
The Golden Knights love the puck through the neutral zone. Wonderful stop. And he holds on, and the whistle stops playing. A little under four minutes to go in the second. The Oilers have a one-goal lead. They recently broke the tie. They won that draw. Sails it. Terrific save off the redirect. Scooped up by Cassie. Shoots one. Puck controlled now by the defense. Edmonton's controlling play through center ice. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Nice work by Paul Stastny. Smart recovery by Ryan Nugent Hopkins. What a tremendous hit. Stone's not shy to throw his body around here at any time. Puck grab, they're ready to go. Perfect wrister. Deflected off the blocker. He's roaming from the crease and looking. Vegas leaves its own end. Brings a shot. Oh, terrific save on a great chance. That great save was all positioning. I think this is a good point to hear from Ray Ferraro. The Golden Knights have been a disaster defensively. They've had no gap control, and they have not helped their goalie out at all. I understand what you're saying, Ray. There's no denying that, but much of this game lies ahead. Let's just see. Critical win where they need it. Say! Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in play. Good offensive zone win. Score! And this one is tied. The Golden Knights have this thing tied up, and we are late in the second period. Should be fun going forward. Neutralized face-off win. Maybe can change the tide at center ice. And he's tripped, and there'll be a penalty. Whistle is blown, and the guilty party heads off the ice. Merrill's going to the box. It's a tripping minor. Edmonton's to the power play again. They have been deadly so far in the game. Oh, and he missed the net. Well, that's a good scoring chance. He's trying to be too fine, trying to pick the corner. Sometimes you've just got to shoot it at the middle of the net. Made that stop. And he puts the glove on it and stops playing. The Oilers with a face-off win. The drama heightens in this final minute of the second period. Crosses that line. Cassian's tripped up. That should be a penalty. Reeves gets his name on the penalty sheet. A tripping minor. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. Edmonton's power play gets a five-on-three, and it's a long one. Let's see how they perform. One of the biggest mistakes a five-on-three power play makes is they're looking for the perfect shot. The more you shoot it, the more you move the penalty killers around and you start to tire them out. Use that stick like a magic wand. Outstanding save. What magic even to get there and get the shot off. Equal to the challenge. Nice stop. They win the draw. Flies one to Nugent Hopkins. Clock continues to get to the smaller numbers here, but there may be time for another rush. No luck! You can't miss by a much smaller margin than that. He rifled it just wide of the net. Solid work there by Nugent Hopkins. Dreisaitl's tripped, and a penalty should be coming. McNabb's headed to the penalty box. A minor for tripping. The Oilers are presented with a great opportunity here. It's a long five on three. He better be careful. This is multiple penalties again tonight. If you continue to take penalties like this, you're going to find yourself parked in the middle of the bench. Two periods have been played here. 
It is a tight kind of game as we await the third. Somebody's got to break this tie in the third. There's been a ton of scoring, but no advantage yet. Period begins with one team still short. Penalty kill will begin with this faceoff. He won't avoid. There's a drive after the whistle. There's one of those unwritten rules. You can't do that after the whistle. They used their fists and got a fistful. Five each for fighting. You almost forget that they're going to keep track of the game by score here. The players seem to want to settle a score on every whistle. It's a face-off win. May not seem important in that territory, but they have possession. He imposed his will. Vegas is starting things up, but back deep. Not there! Wasn't too far off, but ultimately not on the net. A shot. Save. Puck picked up here. Went to the backhand. Save there. Haven't seen a lot of this, Doc, after whistles. Let's keep an eye on this type of play. It might lead to something else. Edmonton's prevailed on another faceoff. The Oilers skated up on the side. Goes to the backhand. And that one turned aside. The Oilers up the wing, luck the puck. Let's it go. And a save. Goalie's one of the six guys on the ice. He can pass. He did that. Trying for it. Save with the pad. And ring more bells on that one. One another I thought the second was the toughest what a move on that one with the stick can he clear gathered up again by Miller just a backhand tripped up on the play and there will be a penalty pass attempt to Kara Puck loose, just a speed bump off the defense. The Golden Knights get a two-minute penalty for tripping. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do is sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. Edmonton's special teams have been special. Let's see if they come up big here. It's a two-man advantage, and it's not short. One of the biggest problems on a five-on-three is teams are too cautious. They don't shoot the puck enough, and they make it too easy for the penalty killers to kill it off. Won that face off. Now what? Not on the net. Hard shot there, Doc. Someone checked the radar. Dreisaitl's tripped up. That should be a penalty. Whistle is blown. Penalty call. Guilty party departs. Vegas has given a two-minute minor for tripping. The Oilers get another power play opportunity, and they have been superb so far. You're right, Doc. This is a big advantage here. Five on three on the power play. It's one you have to capitalize on. Break away! Save! The power play will reset as it's picked up by Ryan Nugent Hopkins. He's all alone! Comes up big on the breakaway! McDavid's dropped another draw in this close one. The Golden Knights keep the play going in the middle. Flings it off the mark. He hammered that puck and it just missed. Dreisaitl is tripped and a penalty should be coming. On the delayed penalty, the change is made and the extra man is out there. Couldn't get through and retain possession. Gathered up again by Nugent Hopkins. And now the whistle signals stoppage of play and will get the penalty. 
Holden's going to the box, and the call is tripping. Every game presents a fork in the road opportunity, and this is it. It's a long five-on-three power play, and it begins now. Good job on the draw. This five-on-three power play has to be careful that they don't get lulled into a sense of security here, and they move the puck around the outside and never challenge the penalty killers. McPherson's going to the box. A player hit the ice, and the call on them is tripping. You can just see the confidence when a team is lightning-like on the power play, and this one is. They get another chance beginning now. You don't get too many chances like this, Doc. A five-on-three power play. The key is to be aggressive, get the puck to the net, make those three penalty killers move all over the place. Great save. Did not go very well that time. Loose puck. Good defensive play, hand to eye and center ice. Muscled long to McNabb. Loose puck knocked away by Ryan Nugent Hopkins. From the outside, score! Edmonton's gotten the lead here, breaking the tie in the third period. What a raucous ride to the finish we're going to have now. The Oilers control from the neutral zone. By number 93. That one is pointed to him. Oh, snaps the shot. Flex that leg right out there and blocked it. Just a hair under four minutes have gone by. Edmonton's lead is one, and it's a fresh lead. Defensive zone win. Merrill's carrying it back in his own end. Hope breaks free. Wonderful stop. That puck is held, and the whistle stops play. The Oilers with a clean win on the draw. Vegas has control of the puck in the defensive zone. Fires a shot. Good work there in goal. Intended it, but it hit it. Bennings tripped up. That should be a penalty. Whistle is blown. And a man with guilt all over his face is going to the box. Stone's going to the box. It's a tripping minor. Solid clean win. 61. Mark Stone. Two minutes for tripping. Time of the penalty. McDavid stripped, and a penalty should be coming. The Golden Knights suffer a tripping call. The Oilers get a huge opportunity here. It's a two-man advantage, and it's a long one. Let's see how they do. Nice face-off work. One of the biggest mistakes a five-on-three power play makes is they're looking for the perfect shot. But no team worth its name is going to let that go. And for every action, there's a reaction. When you make a play like that, usually the end result is this. this both receive fighting majors this is old time hockey every whistle invites a scrum guys seem to be more involved punching each other in the nose than they are trying to score a goal clearly had the short end of that fight and during the altercation he's been banged up a little bit he's heading towards the players bench not to the penalty box slid to dry side breakaway chance oh how can they miss that pass missed wide Long lead pass to Bouchard. He can start some danger here. And he's hit again. He'll feel that one tomorrow. That shot came from just six inches. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. Makes that play deep. Drives ahead. It's just him. And coming up, we will see a penalty shot. It's a rarity to see one penalty shot in the game, but we've seen more than that because the defenders can't keep up. Now, this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. 
Subban's able to make the save on the most exciting play in hockey, the penalty shot. The shooter made a good shot, just not good enough. A tad over five minutes have been played in this, the third period. So this game has gone from being dead even to a leader. Vegas in their own end on the move now. Gets across, looks over his options. Yamamoto slashed, and the arm of the referee is up. A penalty will be coming. Edmonton's taking advantage of the delayed call. The goalie is off. Fires! That puck struck him in front. And now, after that period of time, we get the whistle and the penalty call. Merrill's penalized two minutes for slashing. Oh, look at the reaction of the puck carrier. He is in some pain. That's a slash. Edmonton's power play gets a five on three, and it's a long one. Let's see how they perform. McDavid failed on yet another faceoff in this close game. One of the biggest problems on a five on three is teams are too cautious. They don't shoot the puck enough, and they make it too easy for the penalty killers to kill it off. Clean win on the draw. The Golden Knights in their own end controlling play now. That one's flopped in. Edmonton's going back further to get restarted on this man advantage. The Oilers with a center ice faceoff win. Onside. In all alone. Stands his ground on the breakaway. That's a free puck thanks to the play by Cassie. Got it back. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Routine save. Kicked away. Let's it go. Save. Vegas setting things up in the defensive zone. Terrific determination by Nugent Hopkins. The Golden Knights with control at center ice. Offside is called. Somebody got over anxious there. A little under seven minutes gone. The Oilers lead by a goal. They just broke the tie moments ago. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? Linesman signals an offside. They've got the draw. And the puck heads to the neutral zone, and so everybody has to get reset. Vegas is leaving the defensive zone behind. Turned a shot on net. The pad came in handy that time. Edmonton's looking to head man up the wing. And he dumps it in. Laid on the Holden. Full steam up the wing. Let's it go. Got oh, the puck's in the net. It's a goal. Up a goal and on a power play, you really think you can take a stranglehold of this game. But the momentum has been tipped, and this game has been turned on its head with this shorthanded goal. They win the draw it's and will now set up an attack. Breakaway. An outstanding save. He didn't go for the deep. Time of the goal. Seven minutes. Driving in from no man's land. Waffle boarded. Score! A shorthanded goal yet again. The Golden Knights have scored an important goal. They now lead by one. There's still time left, but the advantage so far has been with them in time of possession. And the face-offs won. Got to ice it here. Gains the zone. A great opportunity, but he missed the net. Doesn't matter how hard you shoot it, he missed the net by a mile. Gonna have to go chase it down. Shot on. Ooh, what a break. Shot hit the man. Outstanding point-blank save. Great display of goaltending right there, Doc. For the blast. Got it all. He covers and has defused the attack for now.
Over eight minutes have passed, third period. We were tied, and now it's a one-goal game. Puck grab, they've got it ready. Edmonton's leaving its own end. Can he make them chase it? Is able to move on in. Pitching it to Stone. And he's hit again and hard. He's got a target on his back. Big chance. Moving along in their own end. Back and forth. Breaks away. Poke checked away. Vegas in control of the puck up the wing. A shot. Oh, and he misses. Wicked shot there, Doc. Long lead pass to McPherson. The Oilers get the puck with just a few seconds left on their power play. Couldn't get through there. A superb hit. A great hockey play there. Dreisaitl's not going to be too happy with that. He didn't have his head up, wasn't aware of everybody around him, and then he got steamrolled. Not sure who made the hit, but that is a big one. The Golden Knights starting back in their own end. Nicely into the zone. A rocket! In front! Wide with the shot! Collected by Ryan Nugent Hopkins. And he's tripped, and there'll be a penalty. And now we get the stoppage of play in the penalty call. Miller's headed to the penalty box, a minor for tripping. Let's check in at ice level with Ray. The Oilers bench has a little more room on it. That injured player will not return tonight. Vegas continues on in their own end. Gains the blue line. Brings a shot. They score! Another short-handed goal! Do you believe these guys? Golden Knights are now up by two. They're going to face an onslaught here near the end of the game, and they know it. We are in the third period, but they have a two-goal lead. The Oilers win the draw. What's next? Got to clear it here. Vegas gates upwards along the side. Oh, broke it up. Puck is thrown to Yamamoto. That went off someone who's puck. He's got no hip pocket. It's a good thing. He just got swiped. And that one went offside. I think it's time we hear from Ray Ferraro. McNabb's earlier fight is really the only sign of life his team had early. But since that time, they've been the more aggressive of the teams, and the context of the game has completely changed. He is fun to watch, isn't he, Ray? We'll do more of that now. A marvelous job in the face-off circle today. There's an example. Moved along and in. Save there. Shoots. Wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. The goalie makes himself look big. Face-off win here. Twist one. Wow, what a glove save. Solid win of the draw. With a blast! McPherson's clearly in some anguish here. He's working his way back to the bench, but he's hurt. And the pass goes back over the blue line, so they have to recoil. Passing one off now to Theodore. Gains the zone and looks over his options. A shot! Great save in close! Let's it rip! Not on the net! Boy, this puck had a lot of steam on it, but unfortunately he turned his hands over, and that's what caused the puck to miss the net badly the golden knights with possession in the neutral zone one on one
beautiful stop on a great scoring chance. Ah, oh, that's a good quick poke check there. And a save. And freezes play. And you'll see tonight's winning 50 50 draw number. Congratulations to the guy or girl who's got the lucky ticket. Edmonton's got a defensive zone win. Hawk loose. Strong defensive play by Carlson. Moves it to the corner. Got his glove on that one. The Oilers' power play unit. Good sometimes, not others. And this was one of the others. Propel to McDavid. Shoots. Perfect save. Carlson's got it in the defensive zone, headed to center. Shoots one. Terrific opportunity, but it's off the mark. Wicked shot there. That's why I wasn't a goalie, Doc. And they've got it again. Vegas charges up the wing. At the front of the net. Good, solid poke check there. And it's all missed the net. You give him time and space, and he's going to let that shot fly. Puck cleared back down the ice, and it is icing. I'd like to thank you for all of your support. Pretty easy save for the goaltender as he just handles that. He handles about 100 of those in practice a day. Solid face-off win. He was able to see it all the way and blocked it. Hatchets one. Oh, deflected away. Stood up there and blocked that shot. Looks ahead to start something. Loose puck. The defense got in the way there. In with it now. Break away. He shuts him right down. Let's it go. Edmonton's got the puck in the neutral zone. Shifts to the backhand and shoots. Great save. Many yards gain to carry it. Shoots one. Lightning white reflexes there. Great glove save. You know what, Doc? Instead of acting like this after the whistle, how about both teams play whistle to whistle like this? They weren't going to let this one go through the rest of the game without settling it this way. their fists and got a fistful five each for fighting you almost forget that they're going to keep track of the game by score here the players seem to want to settle a score on every whistle Holden's rattled after that last fight guys he's headed towards the players box not to the penalty box Stastny's got another in a long list of face-off wins. Wonderful save. You know, there's a little bit of a luck involved there. The goalie was screened on a play. He couldn't see it, but he stopped it. And play is stopped for a penalty. The Golden Knights are going to the box for two minutes, and the call is tripping. Edmonton's power play unit has reached this critical point in the game. They have some confidence. Let's Vegas see if they can make a difference here. Number 28, William Vegas Gilliam. carrying it in the defensive zone. Time of the penalty. Play is offside, and so we get a halt. Edmonton's got another face-off win. Knocked off the puck. Couldn't get his way through. And he shoots just wide. The Golden Knights along the board skating at mid-ice. Wonderful stop. And holds on to that puck to get the whistle. Brodziak won that one. Good for him. He's had a bad night. Able to attack now. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Terrific determination by Ike. And the puck goes back out to center ice, and so everything will have to get reset. Vegas shifting gears back in their own end. 
He's got it, but has to get rid of it. Flings it. Say. The Oilers lug that along in the defensive zone. Picks it up back there. Oh, and it's a penalty coming. Yamamoto has just thrown his team on his back today. He just jumped back on the ice where he's been spectacular all over the place and all over the score sheet, too. Edmonton's power play has been good, not great. But let's see if this is the one that they strike on. It's important. You don't get too many chances like this, Doc. A five-on-three power play. The key is to be aggressive, get the puck to the net, make those three penalty killers move all over the place. Let's it go. Save there. A very big faceoff win here. Okay. He was standing in the lane and got some of it. And now it's directed to Cassian. Can he beat him here? Skill play by Cassian. Shoots. He got a piece of that one. That was a tougher stop than a look. Free puck off a defender. That roadblock was set up. Ooh, it lay there, but he got the whistle and stoppage of play. Okay, now they've won it. Let's see. Let's it go. Save. Off that save, the puck has gone over the glass. Out of play. Brogziak's lost another draw. Gotta get better. Still, the game's close. Gets in, and he'll look over his options. Wonderful save. He was hovering right over it. A strong pad stop there. Shoots one. Missed the net. Collect it now. That was the wall that stopped it. Nice work with that stick. Knocked it away. Need to get rid of it. He's got this one, and they're after him. A great wrist shot. Punched away. The Golden Knights skate along the perimeter in the neutral zone. Shot. Outstanding save. Difficult opportunity. Well, that's a solid save. The Oilers go back to pick it up. Time is dwindling on this power play. Sakara's in his own end, headed towards center. Oh, he's got this one, but can they catch up to him? A breakaway stop there. The Oilers empty their net. He's at the bench. Oh, what a terrific save in close. We are in the 60th minute out of 60. On to dry side. And off target with that one. Oh, what a great chance. That would have really put the pressure on. It's brought on, and here's an opposite corner dump of the puck. Score! That one should put the icing on the cake. That's going to be too much for them to come back from that empty net or seal the deal. And they've won the faceoff. Puck loose, couldn't get through. That play goes offside. Terrific face-off win, and that's one of many. And that puck goes offside. And that's a face-off win. It's dumped in. He's got it. Loose puck due to the play by Miller. They've won the neutral zone faceoff. 
Good place to shoot from, and he does. The Oilers are driving it from the wing. Gathered up by Carlson. Nice save there. They're going to have to do better than that to beat him. A brilliant save at the horn. It's a preseason victory. Veterans of the league won't look at it as much, but they did when it was theirs. The rookie has gotten his first win of any kind. All right, let's not get too excited. It's just the preseason, but we've seen...